Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can design a screw jack in Kitia V5. On the right side you can see the completed design of the screw jack which is being disassembled and you can see the different parts. So this series is all about designing the different parts of the screw jack and on the left side you can see the different drawings which are required to do the design. So I'll be showing you how you can design part by part each part of the screw jack and on this tutorial I will we'll be working on the CSK screw which is a sixth part of the design. Alright, so I'll just open up a new file, new drawing and I'll name it as screw jack space 6 space CSK screw Alright, that means that uh, we're going to design the CSS, CSK screw of the 6th part, which is the 6th part. Okay, and select the front plane as usual and come into the sketch. Alright, now we're going to design this portion here. It means that we need to do a uh, sketch something like this. So it's not so important that uh, you have to do it so fast or you have to make the sketch so fast as I, as I did that must uh, become in by practice so this is a 45 degree and don't worry about the inner dimensions and uh, all these uh, slots and all we'll do that later now we'll do this uh, 6 and from this point to this line must be now there is six and this is it's already given there and the total height is uh, 30 it's completely toned green that means that uh, the sketch is completely constrained you can also go to sketch analysis see that it's an implicit profile with closed status and a five curves make sure yours is the same come out of the sketch and do a shaft with respect to the z axis click on ok and you got that so let me just come back to the sketch once again and explain you something you can see that uh, a kind of slot is over here why didn't I design that slot there if I had designed such a slot and if I had done the shaft we would have got a hole over here instead of getting a slot so we should be doing that slot once we have already done the shafting now let's just uh, select the front plane once again and come to the sketch and then use the centered rectangle preferably and draw the centered rectangle on this axis here and name its uh, depth as 3 and its width as 2 and make him tangent and coincident with this that's it so as I've se selected the centered rectangle I didn't have to make it uh, you know uh, symmetric and all that that's already automatically done in that mother sketch and then use a pocket up to next on both sides come out of the sketch and we got the CSK screw a small thing is to be done next so that is uh, select this and do a chamfer for it chamfer of one in one preview and uh, another thing what you need to do is uh, select the uh, tape, uh, the thread or tape so select uh, this lateral face and the this particular portion here and give a thread depth of uh, somewhere till here alright and click on OK and our threading is also done and our CSK screw is ready so it's of uh, thickness 2 and depth of 3 alright and that's all for this particular part of the tutorial uh, we're gonna use all of these uh, parts which we have designed in the whole series of tutorials and we're gonna assemble all of them together and uh, that's all if you have any doubts regarding this tutorial comment just below on this video and I'll be getting in touch with you if you have any CAD projects 
please write to me at katia.pro.user at gmail.com c-a-t-i-a.pro.user at gmail.com and I'll be getting in touch with you. Thank you so much and stay tuned till the next tutorial arrives.